Good morning, you guys, and happy Sunday. We're gonna do a random Sunday. I feel like chemistry. I won't let no one come and take your place. First off, I'm going to church. I have on this ugly behind sweater because the sweater I wanted to wear. Well, I guess it's not ugly. My mom has on. But yeah, we're fitting to go to church because we're about to be late. So let's do that and then I'll catch up with y'all later. Alrighty, y'all. So just came back from church and I feel like, okay, usually I work on Sundays. So like I usually like cannot go to church like in person. So I like watch it online most weeks. But I feel like I'm going to start like just going to work later and actually going to church because it just feels so good to start your week off with like, like it's like empowering for me. I don't know about everybody else, but for me at my church, look, I felt empowered to like start my week. But yeah, now I'm gonna change clothes and we're gonna go. We have like some errands to run. So yeah, we're gonna do that. And I'm gonna bring y'all along. But first I gotta take this freaking turtleneck off because it's making me look like I just have a freaking big head. And I don't even like this sweater because look at this. Like, what is that? But my mom had on the sweater that I wanted to wear of hers, so I had to wear this one. But yeah, okay, enough chat, I always just be talking, talking, talking. But yeah, okay, let me take this off. Okay, y'all, before I go, I also wanted to show y'all these freaking Curve Love Abercrombie jeans because I just feel like everybody needs them in their life. Um, this is them. Like, I'm gonna go get a size excuse my underwear line I'm gonna go get them in a size 2 this is a size 4 but these are just the most flattering jeans like imagine if my waist was at it was actually like the right size like everybody needs these they're so cute I don't want to get my head hit by the fan let me try to show you guys look at the freaking detailing I made a TikTok about it, but I just want y'all to go get them while they're freaking on sale. Um, Cause usually they're like $100. And right now they're on sale for like, not $100. I think it's like 50% off or something. So literally run, the jeans are amazing and you need them. Okay guys, so right now we're at an undisclosed location. There's a vlog. It's so weird cause it's like two other vlogs going on. I'm filming clips for two other vlogs. But anyways, we're at undisclosed location. But after this, we're gonna go like return the stuff that I already told y'all, like the Abercrombie jeans. And then I also have a pair of airy leggings, but they're the like flare ones. But I think I'm gonna return them for the regular. What do you think, mom? I just don't like love the this? flare, I don't think. So yeah, we're gonna do this and then we'll go to perimeter. Period. Say period, mom. Period. <laughs> yeah. Y'all, we're at perimeter. You know, you know. I used to go to this mall by myself, but then I stopped because all that trafficking stuff they had here. No, I didn't know they had a shootout. Yeah. <laughs> We're going to Abercrombie and Fitch in Abercrombie and Fitch. That's what I say, but y'all know I have a hard time sticking to the rules when I when it involves shopping. But we're gonna try. Look how much shorter she is than me. Y'all, they better let me listen. My dad lost the freaking receipt. How do you lose a receipt they send to your email? I can't understand that. But leave it to him, he lost it. So hopefully they let me return it without having the receipt. Cause you know how people try to play sometimes. But we finna see. We made it, there's so much, like let me just show y'all. All this. And then I'm making my mom try on a pair. They don't have the ones that I want, so I have to order them. I hate ordering from them though, because it takes freaking forever for them to come. But I don't have a choice. My mom's, she doesn't want me to show y'all. But they look cute. You guys know I had to stop in Zara. I wanted this coat, y'all, in green for sure. But they don't have the green one in store. Hmm. You know, I had to double it. Is that the line? Oh, no. Y'all, the line is all the way out the 
store on the other side and I will not be waiting. People always be looking at me like, mom, the line is all the way like out the door. Okay guys, brief update. And people keep freaking staring at me, I don't understand. But anyways, um, we went to H&M so my mom could return something, right? The tag had like fallen off, I guess, when my dad bought it. So the tag was like in the back pocket, but it wasn't like ripped at the top. Tell me why the lady wouldn't let us return it. Cause she was like, the tag has to be on or you have to go to your original store. I'm like girl, what? I feel like they just be saying, she was so rude, like so rude. I feel like they just be saying stuff when they don't like want to deal with it. But yeah, that happened. I went to try to return my leggings, but there's no area in here. But there's an American Eagle, so I'm just gonna have to go to the Mall Jordan River. Um, what else? I return, okay. Listen, Paul didn't put his name on the freaking, he didn't put his email just right on the Abercrombie order. So I couldn't return the pants or exchange them without him. So he gotta bring the pants up here. But I did return the other two pairs I had and I ordered the correct size of the ones that I just showed, showed y'all earlier and then he'll send me the money when he comes up here or whatever. But yeah, that's what's been going on. I was so upset, like you know when you get mad when like somebody talks to your mom crazy? Like, I was so upset at the freaking H&M lady because why are you being rude? Like, so, man, we did not ask you to be working at H&M on a Sunday. Like, there's no need to be rude. But yeah, my mom's in the bathroom. People keep staring at me. I mean, I don't think I look that weird. I just have a camera in my hand. Hopefully we'll get some food. I'm freaking hungry. And then I gotta decide whether I wanna go to Airy to return this stuff or not. So yeah, that's your update, y'all. Is Urban Outfitters going out of business? Cause where, where is, look, so skimp. Where are the clothes? Guys, if you don't get a pretzel from the mall, did you really go? Mmm. Mmm. Mm, mom. Let me put y'all into the pecan pretzel. Mom, is this called pecan pretzel? Oh, almond. Mm. Okay, y'all. We're at another mall. So many people out today. I don't know what's going on. Y'all, the line is all the way. Maybe we can go to the line back. Oh, you want to see if they have what you want? Okay, maybe I should go return my stuff while you return yours. It'll be our first call to action. Uh, oh, I need a new Nike. $18 now. Y'all, these used to be, what, $9 back when I was young? Mm. Who's gonna pay eighteen dollars for a freaking Nike headband? Absolutely not. Not me. Y'all, back in the day, them headbands did not used to be fourteen dollars. Y'all know which ones I'm talking about? If you you've seen me wear them on here, like the black Nike headband that like any athlete that was a girl wore. Like, why is it fourteen dollars for a? <laughs> A headband? Absolutely not. You have lost your mind. Guys, I was doing well, but they got the freaking wolf up. So I'm obviously have to get some. Maybe just two. Or maybe not. I don't know. We're gonna get some. Let's yeah. see. Y'all, I didn't get any. You guys should be proud of me. Cause they only had Christmas and Thanksgiving stuff and I hate fall flavors. Like I hate fall scents. That's my biggest. Where are we going? Where are you going? We leaving, right? Y'all, we we're at the last place that we're going, and my mom was talking about she wanted she'll drive. 
Yeah, because we're five minutes from the house. Wait, no, let we're me... not. <laughs> but this, y'all, y'all should. I'm Mom, gonna... you was returning stuff too. Y'all, was... parents these days, they'll drive you insane. No, you drive me. <laughs> been in running all day. She don't sit in the passenger seat the whole day. Like she just got a free chauffeur or something. That's how it is when you got somebody to go somewhere. If I asked you to go, I wouldn't expect you. Mom, now when we, this morning at church, you was talking about, are we gonna go to the mall? This mall, I ain't know nothing about no perimeter. Child. Okay, but now the question is, are we going to try Kaba? Or are we gonna, huh? Dang, she. <laughs> I mean, Chipotle, we got it all. Mommy, but what if Kava is not good? We going in there to see what it's about. All right. You heard her. You heard her here first. And Jada and Any, if y'all are watching this, because both of y'all, Jada and Any, y'all were the ones that told me this was good. So if it's not, oh, best believe. Really even dig. So this just reminded me of this time my dad freaking scarred my life. One of the many times. So y'all, I had had this softball. Like obviously, I played softball like my whole life. So I was like playing travel ball. And over the weekend, yeah, that's why Target is. So over the weekend, I had a tournament, right? And I guess I did bad or dropped a ball or something. I really couldn't exactly tell. <laughs> this man, y'all know the tournaments be the whole weekend. So you be drained by the time Sunday come around, just ready to leave the tournament and get, you know, get off the road and like get, shower and lay down or something. This man made me come to Dick's, brought me a new glove, and then made us go out to the field to use it. <laughs> Learn today. Ain't nothing funny, y'all. I could not believe. No, go straight across. I could not believe him. Like, dang. Look what you got to show for the champion. She loved. This is the biggest mommy, mommy, my man, because she loved to ride or die for him. Like, nobody's worried about the championship I won to 10 years later, mom. All right, guys, we made it. Look, guys. My camera's about to die. Gotta go. Y'all, the girl was so freaking sweet. So like they were out of like a bunch of stuff because I guess like the influence of TikTok. Um she was like so many people have been here like the last week or so. So they were like out of like the lemon tahini. They were out of pita bread. Like all of it. What else is she? Some other sauce. Their top two sauces they didn't have. So she gave me or my whole bowl for. Oh yeah, or my mom doesn't eat. Well, she eats seafood, but not like chicken and stuff. And they were out of like the veggie, like the cauliflower mix, and they only had falafel. But she gave me my whole. Um, she just gave mine for free because my mom still wanted to try it. But I was like, oh, like no, thank you then. And she was like, well, I just put it in there, and you can just try it and see if you like it. Like period, Ellie. So if you're in Buford, go to Kaba by Target and ask for Ellie. She's great. So sweet. Customer service was 10 out of 10. Right, Mom? Yes. <laughs> Alrighty, y'all. Mm. Well. Why do I bite that one? I know I was about to end the video. Anyways, I was just eating some freaking cookie dough. Because if y'all haven't had like the Toll House cookies that you like make homemade, try it. So good. My mom keeps getting mad at me for freaking eating the dough, but like, girl, it is so good. But I did see the raw egg be put into it, so I probably. Mmm. That's just so good. But yeah. Thank y'all so much for watching today's video. Thank you for spending time with me and my lovely mom. It's always so fun, like, being able to go out just for a day and just get things done, but, like, make it fun. So, yeah, thank you all so much for tuning in. I love you all. Stay tuned. This year is going to be big. We have a lot of content coming, a lot of different things happening in my life. So, yeah, stay tuned. I love you guys so much, and um, I appreciate you guys more than you'll ever know. But I'll see you on the next video. Love you all so much. Bye.